Alright, we're going to try something a little different here because we got some leftovers from a dinner that I made and we're just going to add it to this. So we found this kind of soup mix at one of our local grocery stores for a lot less than what we paid for the other. It doesn't have as good of an amount of beans or anything. They're kind of small compared to what we're used to. Hey, you want to help cook, honey? Want to come help me cook? Yeah, good boy. All right, we've got this little bit of beef. I'm going to dice that up real small, get it in there. And here's what we're going to add to it. We need about six cups of liquid. So I'm going to do this whole beef broth. And then I'm going to do this soup with the other two remaining cups. And then we're also going to do these here. We soaked the beans overnight, folks. You got to do that. You want to soak them for at least eight hours. Overnight is preferable. The longer, the better. And then we're going to dice it up and we're going to get it in here. So, basically, that's today's crock pot creation. It's something real small and simple. Here's the ingredients here, like I was saying. Just going to do a little bit of each. Here's the instructions. Although I never follow instructions. If I can help it, I'm not going to cook it like that at all. But if you wanted to check out those instructions, here they are. You can hit pause for that, folks. It's also in Spanish. For any of my Spanish-speaking subscribers there. Stay a little bit longer in case you want to pause it. All right. What I'll do is I'll get back at you later and I'll show you what this looks like. Maybe we'll check on it about halfway through or so. Anyways, thanks so much for watching. We hope you enjoy this and we'll see you here a little bit later. Oh, well, you want to help me some more? Oh, you want to come help me? Come help me. Hi. Oh, my handsome. All right, you tell everybody we'll be back later, okay? Okay. Okay. Hey, we're back. There's just a couple of quick things I forgot to mention. I'm also going to be adding two tablespoons or so of garlic and these mixed veggies. And believe it or not, here's what that leftover meat turned into. It was uh, small in the way of the pie plate, and now it filled it up. Wee -hee! So, here we go. We're going to get more stuff in here. Get that... Roasted red pepper soup and these yummy spices. But since I don't have, you know, the usual veggies, I'm going to wing it today. This will help to add more lima beans to it and green beans. Mm. All right. And if that doesn't seem like enough veggie, maybe I'll do a bag of just green beans as, as well. Keep with the bean theme. <laughs> All right, folks. We'll check back with you when this whole thing is done. And again, thanks so much for watching. Huh, Leo? You happy everybody's watching? Yeah, he's my happy Leo. What a good boy. He's my good boy. What is it, Leo? Huh? What is it, little guy? Okay. Well, earlier I said I was using spices, but my other model was out. I wasn't using garlic powder. I was using onion powder because I put all that minced in it. Here's what it looks like with everything mixed in now. Oh, my goodness. And we'll check back in in about literally 12 hours. We'll see you then.